Today, we're discussing creation of drawing templates. So, we create a new file of type drawings, give it a name, like a underscore template, and uncheck the use default template checkbox to start from scratch. Remove the default model if you have one in session. We can also select a format, browsing to the disk, selecting format underscore template and pressing OK. Now in drawing, we go to tools and switch to template mode. We have now the possibility to add different template views. We can create the first one, giving the name main and reviewing the different option we can retrieve from the model. For example, the combined states, the orientation, simplified representation, exploit state for assemblies or cross-section. We can set a specific scale for the view, retrieve process tape, define model display, here hidden line, uh, do the same for tangent line, uh, and review the setting for snap line, dimension or boom balloon. For this view, we will set the left orientation. So we just type in left and place the view on the top left. It's represented by a drawing symbol for now. We can add other views like projections. As we have already a view, it will be available under type. Main is only view available. And we can set also hidden line as model display and place a view just under the previous one. We can continue, add a third view, this one it will be a 3D view, so we give the name and also specify the orientation available in the model, 3D. We can also retrieve a different simplified representation without screw and place the view on the top right. And at the end we had the last view, which is section view, and retrieve the cross section A and also the hatching definition from the model. And that's done. We completed the creation and can save the drawing template. Now we open the model and review that we have a section called A also from view manager we verify the different simplified representation check we have one called without screws and we create a new orientation called 3d and now we have all the information available to create the new drawing from the template so we create a new file of type drawing, give it a name, like drawing from template, and check the use default template to be sure to pick the right one. So we browse to disk for the last created drawing, and now we resize the window just to check that we have all the four views we defined earlier. And it's done. Now, if we want to set by default this template, we can go to the configuration editor, check the template underscore drawing option, and browse to disk to pick this one. And then save the dot config dot profile to disk for future reuse. Keep in mind that. When you use a template, it's a copy of a file, so it does not use the drawing setup file you have specified in your Configured Pro. So you have to modify the option directly in the drawing template, for example, here the text height. Also note that when you will update or upgrade to a new version, you will need to use the update underscore drawing option, which is hidden, set to all to incorporate all the bug fixes 
that are different between the version where you created the template and then the new version. So now we save it and we are completed.